Hey guys, it's Daria Nettleton and I wanted to give you this Friday mindset video because I was thinking a lot about it when I was working out and you know, it's going to be, you know, a couple of tips I think for this weekend that are important to you as you go into the weekend and you're trying to stay on track. And the first one is, is that charity starts at home. And when I say that people usually, they get a, you know, there's usually a pretty big reaction one way or the other. But what I mean by that is you can't take care of everything else without taking care of you first. You have to start with yourself and we constantly pile things onto our plate and we say we don't have time and we pile it on and we give to everybody else and then we don't give to ourselves. You have to set that time aside, especially when it comes to your health and fitness, to work on you first. Otherwise, you will not have the energy to take care of everything else. And I promise you that because you can take care of the million other things and keep giving yourself away to the million other things, you will break down. There will come a time and a point where it will fall apart for you. So I'm telling you right now that it's so important that you start with yourself and that means your, your physical health as well as mental health as well. And for me, it's working out and reading personal development every day. So whether it's like 10 pages of a favorite book or something like that, but really you have to start at home. The second part of this equation is you because you are responsible for you. So no, no coach, no personal trainer, no um, fitness class or anything is going to do it for you unless you are invested. So you have to be invested in you. You have to follow through. And by that, I mean, when we're going into the weekend, it's very easy to say, oh, I really worked out hard this week and I stayed on my meal plan. And what if, what, it doesn't matter if I skip a workout or I cheat on my nutrition plan or whatever. And then on Monday, you're feeling miserable or it starts to cascade and it becomes more than one day, then it's two days and it's three days. The next thing you know, you're tossing M&Ms into your mouth like Tic Tacs. And then you're like, wait a minute, this plan doesn't work. This Pilates class doesn't work. This you know, nutrition plan doesn't work. Or this program that Daria told me about, that's not working. But when you dial in to your nutrition and when you dial in to what behaviors you've been doing the past days before, you might find that there's a pattern that you kind of like, I don't know, went off track and then you crashed and went down the ravine. And so I'm telling you right now, guys, you are responsible for you. And that's a hard thing. And I got to admit to you right now that even doing this workout today, if I wasn't filming and taking pictures the way that I do so I can share my workouts with you, I might cheat a little bit and I might not get through that whole set. Or I might say, hmm. Wow, it's only been 10 minutes, I'm sweating my butt off and maybe I can skip today because I have another class I'm doing today or, you know, and it's so easy to make those excuses for yourself and give yourself a way out. And I'm telling you, don't do it. One of the reasons that I do take accountability pictures and take all this video is because it keeps me accountable because then I am gonna follow through. So that's, I'm just giving you that for the day. I mean, it's, it's a hard thing to do to, no matter whether you're in a group class or whether you're doing it at home and you're doing it on your TV, it's hard to get through it for everybody. We all struggle and some days we half it and some days we give it 110% and you got to keep working at it because you're going to get better. I promise you that. Okay guys. So have a fantastic Friday. It's Friday. Get your sweat in. I want you to feel great and have a great day. All right. Bye.